Wayne Michael Carter Jr., born September 27, 1982. Known professionally as Lil Wayne, is an American rapper, singer, songwriter, record executive, entrepreneur, and actor. His career began in 1995, at the age of 12 when he was discovered by Birdman and joined Cash Money Records as the youngest member of the label. Here are four biggest Lil Wayne feuds with other rappers in history. Hello viewers, if you're visiting this channel for the first time or if you are yet to subscribe please hit the subscription button and the bell icon below so you will be getting our video updates. It will only take 3 seconds to do so thanks. Number 1. Juvenile. Lil Wayne began feuding with former Hot Boys member and Cash Money Records Labelmate Juvenile in 2002, after Juvenile took offense to Lil Wayne naming his third studio album 500 Degrees, a diss aimed towards Juvenile whose last album was named 400 Degrees. Juvenile responded with a diss track on his 2002 album 600 Degrees, titled, A Ho. In the song, Juvenile questions Lil Wayne's sexuality, and claims he's a fake gangster. The two squashed their beef for a short period in 2004, with Wayne and Bergman appearing in the music video for Juvenile and Soldier Slim's song, Slow Motion. Number 2. Pusha T. Tension between Wayne and American rapper, Pusha T, had been going on for years, beginning soon after Clips and Birdman worked on, What Happened to That Boy, the latter's 2002 single. In 2006, Wayne felt the Clips song, Mr. M2, was directed at him which caused more tension between the two. In 2012 after much speculation that Pusha T was subliminally dissing Canadian rapper and Wayne's young money signee Drake in several songs, the speculation heightened after the release of Pusha T's, Exodus 23, 1, song. Lil Wayne quickly responded on online social networking service Twitter and later released a diss track titled, Ghoulish. Number 3, Young Buck. Young Buck released a song featuring Tony Yeo called, Off Parole, which insulted Lil Wayne. Young Buck said that Lil Wayne could not be angry, because Young Buck spoke the truth. Young Buck also said, you think you got a problem with Juve and BG, you'll have a true problem with me, referring to the Cash Money Juvenile, BG feud, one of the reasons 50 Cent stated he was dismissing Young Buck was what he called, inconsistent behavior, which included appearing on stage with Lil Wayne, then seemingly dissing him on records with G-Unit. After he was dismissed, Young Buck appeared in the music video, My Life by the Game, which featured Lil Wayne in the vocals. As of 2009 Buck and Wayne have squashed their beef and also linked up to record a track, Ups and Downs, for Young Buck's Back on My Buck Shit mixtape. Number 4 which we consider to be the biggest feud is with rapper Jays. In a 2009 interview with Tropical TV, Birdman disputed the MTV poll that voted Jay-Z, the hottest MC in the game, stating that Lil Wayne was a better rapper and made more money. In early 2011, when Jay-Z and Kanye West's single, H.A.M., was released, Jay-Z took shots at Birdman, saying, Really, you got baby money, and, you ain't got my lady's money. On August 24, 2011, a song called, It's Good, by Lil Wayne, featuring Drake and Jadakiss, was leaked online and included Lil Wayne responding, talking about baby money. I gotcha baby money. Kidnap your bitch, get that, how much you love your lady. Money. Jadakiss later absolved himself of involvement in any brewing beef on his official Twitter feed. Thanks for watching please subscribe for more videos.